All right, man, I paid you 300 for the hoverboard. What do you do? 4,000 for the travel trailer. Let's shake on it at five. There we go. Thank you, sir. I'm going to park it behind my house so then he doesn't see it because I don't want him knowing that I was late because of that. Well, I slept good last night here. This was the first night in the new camper. Everything worked good. I'd run water. I had the AC going. So let's jump out. I got to get to work here. For now on, I'm taking the hoverboard to work because the drive is so short and I've been spending so much on gas recently. So this is a good start for my morning. Got the cool air going through my face. But I think today I'm going to let Garrett know that I bought a camper. I know he's going to be a bit upset for me spending the money, but I just got to show him that I can flip it and make some money. Yo, boss man, you here? Is his computer on? No, he's not here. Yo, boss man, nobody's in here. What the heck? Wait a second. Who's that pulling in? He's hanging on the horn. Hey, you're late for work, boss man. I know I'm late, but man, what do you think about the setup? I just got a new truck here. I was going to say, who the heck is pulling in here like a crazy man? But I guess... Kind of thought it was you, but what is this, a Nissan? Yeah, it's a Nissan Titan, man. Do you like it? Not really. I'm either what? a Ford, Chevy, or Dodge guy. Look, 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 look. Check out the friend, okay? At most. Here. At most, you could do a Toyota Tundra, but I don't know about this. In a man, Honda Ridgeline? Look at the front lights. Is it a nice setup? Yeah, all trucks have nice front lights nowadays. Ah, okay, okay, fine, whatever. Anyways, this is yours, man. I got you a house finally, and... Before you say anything, I know you've been living across the street. You realize, like, my cousin lives there. He, he's the one who rents out that to you. Okay. So I've known about this entire time, and he loves having you there, but he wants to use that house that you're living in, or pretty much a shed, to actually store tools. So I got you this thing. All right. That uh, that should work. Come so check out you want me to live inside, in it. man. You were thinking. I want you to live in it. Yeah, man. Here, hop on in. Nice finish. I like the flooring. A little rustic. Yeah, man, like, it, it's it's nothing too fancy, but... Skylights, you know, the ceiling could be a bit taller, but I'll make do with it. Yeah, it, it's it's a lot better than what you're currently Sink, living in, I'd oven, say. you got a refrigerator. Yeah, the appliances are newer. I like how, like, the floor matches the countertops. Kind of seems cool. Go into the bathroom, man. All right, yeah. Okay, you finished it. Wow. Why would you yeah. put... Oh, okay, I was going to say, is this tile on the walls? No, it's just like a paper thing. Then this is the shower. Nice. Nice walk-in shower. Saves a lot of space. So you like it, man? I think it'll work. I just... Can my truck... My truck should be able to pull it, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, this should have no problem. Did you ride the Segway here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sick and tired of spending gas, so if your little Nissan Titan can do it, my Ford can. Yeah, no, this thing can do it no problem. So, man... Here's what I need you to do. I, usually I have you working right away in the morning, but yeah. instead I want you to go get your truck, come on over here with it, connect to this, and then just get the set up at that land. At the same spot I'm at or where at? Yeah, 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 near there, but not my truck, man. This is my truck. I know, I know. I'm just getting out of the way so when we have all these customers come in once we open, they got a spot to park. Oh yeah, there's always so many customers, right, right, for sure. All right, there we go. We'll park this up front. I'm thinking that we're going to, you just keep buying vehicles, so it looks like when people drive by that, we're actually doing business. Yeah, man, it looks like we just have a bunch of people in here. Joke's on them. We haven't had a customer in months. Grab your truck, and then come pick up the camper. 10-4. All right. Look to the left, look to the right. We're good. Straight across, man. This hoverboard, this is fun. I get a few weird looks from people, especially older people. They're like, what the heck is going on? But one thing we can't do is let them see the camper that I have here, which... I haven't told him about. I kind of hinted about it, but yeah, I didn't tell him. And so I still want to, you know, fix it up, flip it, restore it. I want to kind of do that today here. All right, tell me when. All right, slow down. It's okay, you're good, man. Dude, Drive you got to tell me. I was trying to. Here you go. You're the worst. Just put a hand up. That's all you got to do. All right, all right. Well, hey, man, this is looking pretty good. Yeah, it kind of matches my truck too. It looks good. Can you get your tailgate back? I really dislike this look. No, no, no. I like it. Gives me better gas mileage when I'm heading down the road. I, I don't know about that one, but okay. Yeah, man. Whatever. It's like a parachute back there when you got to fold it up. All right. So go get that thing set up, man. Make it nice and homey. And then I'll be over there in a little bit. Okay. 10-4. Can I, can I wash it off real quick? It looks a little dirty. Yeah, yeah. Go wash it off. Here. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to. Come on, man. Here we go. Okay, let's wash it off. I love this power washer because it's got hot water. So things just fly off here. You don't even need to use soap. All right, man, don't use all the water we got. Sorry, man, just cleaned it up. Wanted it to be nice and clean. All right, cheap steak. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, bye. That's your new name. All right, so Garrett said he was going to come over here once I get this set up, so I don't have too much time. I want to try and hide this. I mean, if he sees it, 
I don't know what he's gonna I, I don't want him to feel bad I don't want him to be mad so let's just get this out of here we're gonna move it down the road but I still have work to do I want to like fix it up restore it a bit make it feel a bit cleaner and we might have to flip this faster than I thought so we'll see right, let's try and put it in the bushes back here that way nobody sees her Spencer yeah what's up man why were you disconnected? Oh, no, I just connect back up. I wanted to square it back up to it. So where do you where do you want me to park? You said your cousin wants to use the shack again. Yeah, so you can park like on like this just a side there or something. Just don't be blocking the main entrance. Have you ever used one of these before? No, you're gonna have to show me kind of how to set it up here. Okay. All right. Well, first start by not hitting me. Let's see. Well, get out of my way. So here, come over here. Do you see right down here at the front? Just click this. Okay, and then it comes out. Okay, then the steps come out. Yep, and now you're pretty much level. Well, you're stabilized, not necessarily leveled. But that's fine. I think, um, where's the bed in this? Did I miss so, that? So, yeah, here, let me show you how that all works. A little different than you're probably used to. So you see this table back here? Gotcha. Yeah, so this thing comes down. You kind of see how it's on like a track. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And then these cushions all come out and it makes a pretty comfy bed. Okay, perfect. So I'll be sleeping I, on the high side. I'll just keep my head up. And you can do the same up here if you want. So it's the same kind of config. And then there's an onboard generator, that black panel right there. I'll give us all our power, our water pressure for the water pump. Do you got a spigot around here that we can just hook up to them? Oh yeah, yeah he's got use, a hose. Yeah, exactly, man. You can just use from there. Um, it literally like, he would have loved to have you continue being there, but it's just, he needs that space. So this is a good solution. Yeah, it's probably better for tools to live in there than an actual human being, but yeah, it may do for a little bit. Yeah, and also he says you haven't been paying your rent, but speaking of rent, it's going to be cut in half now, so that's good. Okay, how, how much did you pay for this? How much did I pay for this? This thing cost me around 4000 or $5,000. I can't quite remember. I have a lot of money. I think yeah, we've been I over know, this. I know, I know. We need, uh, I need a weed whacker to get some of these flowers and bushes growing up here. Here, you know what? Go get your weed whacker. Oh, yeah. Set the shop. All right, there we go. We gassed her all up. Make sure she's full of two-stroke oil. We're going to weed it around the camper, probably around the building. Might as well once we're over there. I'll probably just keep this over by me, and if we ever need it, we don't really have any grass around the dealership, so keeping it around here should work good. Oh, man, I just tested out that bathroom. Well, it's pretty nice. No, no, no. You tested yeah, out man. my bathroom? I dropped off all the kids. Oh, I haven't even... I didn't even try it out, man. Can you can you turn the fan on? I kind of smell it from out here. Oh, okay, okay. One sec. Do you mind yeah. if I just borrow the weed eater and I'll I'll keep the shop clean and stuff like that? As long as you actually keep the shop clean, then sure. But well, if I mean, you start like, becoming I'll do lazy, all the, I'll do all the weed eating at the dealership. Okay, if if you'll actually start doing that, it is what you paid for. But if you want to do it for free, go for it. That works. There we go. Yeah, it's a lot cleaner when you actually come in here and start weeding in this stuff. Where do I go to dump the toilet stuff? Oh, uh, I didn't really think about that one. So, well, like, is there, mm. have you, you went camping before. Is there like a recycling yes. place to dump it out at or? Yeah, there are places. If you want to go to them, you definitely can. Um, you could also maybe turn it into fertilizer and just kind of head to a forest. I'll, I'll let that just kind of be up to you. I don't know. But, After you used it, I don't know if I can do that. That might be illegal. Yeah, probably not recommended, but man, you do you. You know, this is your responsibility. I just got it for you as a gift. I hope you like it. I didn't hear you say thank you at all, but that's okay. Oh, yep. No problem. Thank you. Yeah, no problem is right. All right. Well, hey, man, before you go, uh, just literally today, I'm kind of giving you the day off to just enjoy this and get it all situated, but I need you to trust me. Do you trust me? Nope. Okay. Well, today you're going to have to trust me, okay? Trust, like, it's going to be worth it, okay? I need $2,000 from you. I thought you had all the money in the world. I need $2,000 from you. You Just trust me. It will be worth it. Okay. It when do I get it back? Pocket. All I got to know is when do I get it back? You're going to get something back tomorrow. Equivalent? Don't look at me like that. Okay. Okay. I'll do it. I'll do it. Let's see here. Get my glove box here. There you go. Two grand cash. All in 100. All right. Perfect. Thank you. I was worried about getting paid in quarters. Have a good night. Just again, do whatever you want today. I will be back tomorrow or actually hopefully you'll just come on time and if you do you're gonna be really happy all right 10-4 minus two grand out of the window i better see it tomorrow don't worry man it's gonna be worth you still have some money in your pocket right like you aren't like completely broke you have like a few thousand oh yeah yeah okay okay good good all right awesome. talk to you later i'm going to bed man
Yep. Have a good one, man. All right. He went home for the night. I got some time here where we can. I want to clean out the inside. He's got a really nice shop back. I want to power wash the outside. And then I just want to check the wheel bearings. I want to check out at least one side each, see how they are, and then probably repack the bearings with grease just because this thing has been probably sitting for a while. The people I bought it from didn't seem like they did the best maintenance. They're kind of city folk, so hopefully they took it to a place or did it themselves. We'll see. I got to shut these windows. Otherwise, we're going to be spraying water in this thing. One over the sink. That would be terrible to not see that and get water everywhere. All right, we should be good. Might as well turn the light off that way we don't waste any battery. Here we go. Should be watertight. Let's get cleaning it. Hot water pressure washer. Let's get in here because I'm going to be I'm going to be coming in. I got to open these caps off. Get in there. I might have to jack it up too. We'll see. Then there's there's brakes on these wheels. So there's a little like adjuster that you can do on the other side. I got to lay down there and kind of get in there. So I'll try and get it as clean as I can. All right, perfect. Let's grab the shop back real quick. All right, that took a little longer. Inside is completely clean. All right, now I got some jacks, some jack stands, and we're going to get working on these wheel bearings and probably repack the bearings. There we go. That front one on the left side had brand new grease in it. So I'm going to run to the other side. If they did that one, I'm sure they did the other one. Let's just check both sides and we should be good to go. All right. Wheel bearings are good. We got them repacked with grease. And then I just want to make sure everything's good in here. Yep. Made my bed. Check, check, check. Lights are off. Now it's just time to take the best pictures I possibly can. Let's pull it around, get it in the sunlight. And we need to take 10 really good pictures, put it on Facebook Marketplace or Craigslist. And we'll see if somebody somebody tries to buy it here. I'm going to have the lake in the background. Nice blue water, green grass. The orange on it's going to make it look amazing. Heck yeah, there we go. All right, let's take some pictures. There we go. Should be good. And let's get this out of here so we don't get in trouble. Hopefully we get somebody calling here tonight, but hope you guys enjoyed. Hit the like button. I bought it for 5,000. Put a couple hours of cleaning it in, which isn't no big deal. And I'm going to list it for 7,500. So hopefully at most the lowest I'm going to 7,000. So quick 2,000. That'd be pretty good to make. Well, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Yee!